What are you doing to our brain? What have you done to our marriage? What are you doing to our career? Speak out! You ancestral spirit. Fire right now. Every part of this body. You cannot say no. Fire right now. Christ wants to know. I take authority over you now. I command you to speak. What are you doing to her? Where are you from? What is your name? Speak out in the name of Yeshua Mashiach. Fire every part of you. Fire on that face, in that head, in that coven, in that water. Fire, you spiritual husband. Fire on your throne. You ancestral spirit. You cannot say no. Fire right now. Fire right now. Every part of that coven. I release the fire of the Holy Ghost. Speak out, all of you. How many of you are living in this body? Speak out. How many of you are living in this body? What's your name? Speak out. You fuck. Eh? I can't hear you. What did you say? What did you say? You want to change that? You want to change that? You want to confuse her? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? You know he's talking to you. Who are you? Where are you from? Speak out now. Who are you? Where are you from? Eh? You are what? You are a friend. What is your name? What's your name? You cannot say no. Failure. Yes. Failure. How many of you are living? Hmm? Why is it her? Why is it her? Why is it her? No. Who are you? Who are you? What are you? Where are you from? Hmm? The glory. The glory is for you. What's your name? What's your name? What is your name? Praise the Lord. Praise the mighty living Jesus. I'm Oinda Malawi Dokun and I live currently in Wales, United Kingdom. I want to thank God for the opportunity and the rare privilege to have experienced His power, His delivering power, His instant power and miracle. Um, so I had, I met I didn't meet, okay the man of God I saw him on Facebook I saw a particular testimony but thankfully because I had known of him from when I was in Nigeria um, through senior uh, GFID to Barry's ministry I knew I was in safe hands so I was like you know what hello sir I've been having these kinds of dreams and this is what my life seems to be looking like right now um, I'm here dreaming that you know someone's taking things from me dreaming that you know i'm having like sex in my dream and i know that i'm not in that place even physically you know so i was wondering where all these were coming from so i was really desperate i mean i had gone through just stress i don't even want to overflow how scattered or how chaotic my life was um seeing and I know something that everything happens in the spiritual, nothing is happening because I can't just think things through. I knew that there was a reason behind one, two things I was going through. This video is only meant to let you know that God reigns and rules in the affairs of men. And there is no limit, there is no bounds to what God can do or to where you are that the hand of God cannot reach you. No matter how far away you are, no matter what the enemy is doing to you, the power of God is present to deliver you and set you free from every captivity and oppression that the devil has brought upon you or upon your family or upon your marriage or upon your career or upon your finances or upon your ministry. If Christ did it for someone else, he will do much more for you too and for free. He's the same yesterday, today and forever. So I would take fasts, I would pray, of course I would see, have, you know, Possibly some victory in my dream at some point and before I know it something else is happening and I knew Oida you're not a woman of God you're, you're yeah but you need someone and thank God the Lord led me to um, Facebook there and I met and I saw um, Prophet's uh, Facebook page and by God's grace today is Saturday now yesterday there was a deliverance session on my through phone through WhatsApp video call and
Cristo na vida. Hi. Good evening. How are you? I'm doing well. How are you? Sorry, I've not been able to um, call you. I've, um, I've been on the move. That's okay. Yeah, but God's time is um, the best. You, what, how did you even get to, how did you come about me? I know, I, you know, let me start from, I'm just really even grateful to your responses when you say stuff like, yeah, we we hear you. It's just very beautiful to know that, you know, your, I, I, your heart, first of all, is just, I pray that God keeps doing this in me. I even have to keep praying for you that, you know, God just keeps helping what he has called me to do. But, you know, I'm Ibadon, I pray. So I said, was born in Ibadan, went to Concord, went to OBMS, um, then I moved, I went to Afebabalola in Nigeria. Moving to the UK, I don't even know the same kind of struggle I was having in uh, Nigeria where, of course, I know, I know by God's grace, I can sit down for hours and study. I'm not a lazy person. I try my best. I don't want to waste anybody's money. You know, I, I know I like to read. Mm-hmm. But all of a sudden, I don't even know if it was fear, distraction, I was just everywhere and nowhere. I couldn't study for hours. How did you come about me? Oh, yes, by you, 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 you. So I think it was Facebook. It was Facebook. And when I, I think the one that got to me was that auntie's testimony. Which, which uh, one? Um, um, ah, geez, that I was, I was on the phone. I said, "God, this is my story." Which one? Because Which one of them? She, she, um, she said she, her husband. She has gone to Dubai. Um, she has lived in Dubai. No, um, in Malaysia. Ma- yeah, Malaysia. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, hey, I remember. It was. A, it was a, I said I must message you. <laughs> if, let me tell you, the devil is a bastard, sir. I have seen your man. I said. I don't know how to keep praying my prayer. <laughs> hey, Jehovah. <laughs> I left it. So I've seen, I've seen other videos I've gone through. Oh, I was like, oh, um, I see him in Ibadan. He's now in America. Oh, wonderful. I saw the drama you do too. I saw someone else's testimony. So if I had messaged you then, I bet we would have had this phone call thing. Okay. But it's okay. It's, it's okay. Really- it's okay. But your heart is open. Your heart is open. So the Lord is with you. The Lord is going to deliver you. Right about I, at the time I started speaking with Prophet, he immediately just said, You've been having hormonal imbalance too. I'm like, Yes, because I mean, I would always have my period at particular period times, but it would just come and go and come and go. And I'm wondering, I'm not, you know, I was just there thinking about a lot of things. But have you been having um, lately hormonal imbalance? Okay, I'm going to say this. I don't, I don't think so. I think that there was a day recently, I think I told you about the menstrual thing. No. Um, what I realized you was You didn't tell that, me anything about the menstrual anything. Oh yeah, what I told you on my WhatsApp chat was um, okay. that my my breasts were feeling fuller and you know, I had seen like babies in my dream. Well, like six months so ago, I, about six months ago, you probably had some imbalances with your moon maybe about six wow. months ago it has happened to you twice within the last six months where you where like you just feel like you're you have a hormonal imbalance yes irregular yes yes and absolutely it, it has happened within the last six months right like twice or something yes. irregularity yes yes even this month last month i was like why well, am i seeing menstruation in the uh, 11th of a month mm. and again i'm seeing my mom is in my, my mom is in america actually she's like oh oh yeah, don't worry but my mommy me i know what i'm saying okay I know okay that. just look at me open your heart and look at me um you are going to share testimony right you're going to send yes. your testimony you're going to send your testimony you're going to send your testimony so open your eyes and just look at me Open your heart, don't say anything, just look at me. Right now, I take authority over you, foul spirit, tormenting this body. Right now, 
I take authority over you, demon, tormenting this spirit. I render this body uncomfortable for you right now. I command you to come forth. Now, whatever you have been doing to her right now, I render this body uncomfortable for you from the crown of her head to the soles of her feet right now. Fire. Fire. Every part of this body right now. Fire. Right now. Right now. I render this body uncomfortable for you, you foul demon spirit. I take authority over you, spirit husband. Now, what have you been doing to her? Where are you from? In the name of Jesus, I break your power over her right now. Wherever you are from, I command you comfort now. Right now. Every part of her body, I render this body uncomfortable for you right now. Fire! Right now. Fire! Who are you in this body? Speak out now. Who are you? Speak out. Who are you in this body? I command you to speak in the name of Jesus. You cannot. Who are you? Speak out now. Who are you? Where are you from? Speak out. What are you doing to her? Speak out now in the name of Yeshua. You have been exposed. Speak out. Fire right now. Every part of this body. Fire right now. What are you doing to her? What have you done to her? I command you to speak now in the name of Jesus. Speak out. Who are you? What's your name? Where are you from? Speak out now. Speak out now. I command you to speak now. Who are you? Where are you from? Speak out now. I loosen your tongue. Speak now in the name of Jesus. Who are you? What are you doing to her? Speak out now. Where are you from? Fire. Where are you from? What are you doing to her? What have you done to her career? What have you done to her marriage? Speak out now in the name of Jesus. Speak out now. I command you to speak right now. I render this body uncomfortable for you. Right now, speak out. What's your name? Who are you? Who are you? What's your name? What are you doing to her? Where are you from? Speak out. You have been exposed. Who are you? Speak out now. I command you to speak out now. Who are you? What are you doing to her? What are you doing to her brain? What have you done to her marriage? What are you doing to her career? Speak out! You ancestral spirit. Fire right now. Every part of this body. You cannot say no. Fire right now. Christ wants to know. I take authority over you now. I command you to speak. What are you doing to her? Where are you from? What is your name? Speak out in the name of Yeshua Mashiach. Fire every part of you. Fire on that face in that head, in that coven, in that water. Fire, you spiritual husband. Fire on your throne. You ancestral spirit. You cannot say no. Fire right now. Fire right now. Every part of that coven, I release the fire of the Holy Ghost. Speak out, all of you. How many of you are living in this body? Speak out. How many of you are living in this body? What's your name? Speak out. You fuck. Eh? I can't hear you. What did you say? What did you say? You want to change her? You want to confuse her? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? You know he's talking to you. Who are you? Where are you from? Speak out now. Who are you? Where are you from? Eh? You are what? You are a friend. What is your name? What's your name? You cannot say no. Failure. Failure. Yes. Failure. How many of you are reading? Hmm? Why is it her? Why is it her? Why is it her? No. Who are you? Who are you? What are you? Where are you from? Hmm? The glory is for you. What's your name? What's your name? What is your name? What's your name? Why are you waking up? Waking up every time. I command you to speak. What is your name? If I'm waking up, Christ has given me authority to what you are. What is your name? I'm a lover. Eh? I'm a lover. You are a lover. What is your name? Where are you from? Eh? Where are you from? Fire on your head. Fire on your crown. Fire on your coven. 
every part of that body right now. Fire! Where are you from? No. Where are you from? Hmm? No. Shut up! Where are you from? Where are you from? My family. You are from my family. My family. Uh, what is your name? I'm the king of your family. The king of family. What is your name? Speak out now. What's your name? I said I'm their family. King. What? You are their family king. You have a name. Don't you have a name? Are you ashamed of yourself? How long have you been holding her? How did you enter into her body? Oh, eh? Oh, family let me enter. The family let you enter. How? They gave her to me. They gave her to you. When? When did they give her to you? Speak out. When did they give her to you? Fire. Right now. Speak up, I command you to speak. When did they give her to you? What have you done to her career? What are you doing to her marriage? <laughs> what are you doing to her marriage? No marriage. No marriage. How many of you are living in her body? How many of you are living in her body? How many of you are living in a body? Me. How many of you? Me. Speak out! How many of you are living in that body now? Only, me. Only you. So you are confusing her. You are the one that doesn't want her to agree to shine. What else have you done to her? What are you doing to her to her menstrual flow? Speak out! You just want to frustrate her. What else are you doing to her? What else are you doing to her? Has she been, you, you want that to be fornicating? Has she been fornicating? Speak out. So are you making that to fornicate already? Speak out now. You want that to be fornicating? When are you planning to kill her? You spirit of death. You suicide spirit. Check out! When are you planning to kill her? Liar. You lying spirit. You suicide spirit. You think you can hide? Right now, all of you, I command you right now by the fire of the Holy Ghost, I separate her from you right now. I command her brain to be restored. I command her, her, her over everything, her mental phone to be restored. I command her glory to come forth out of her right now. I break your power right now. Out, all of you, you ancestors, I bind you out of her right now. Out of her, you cannot say no. Out right now. Out of her right now. Every poison you are giving to her in her sleep, vomit it now in the name of Jesus. You foul spirit, you spirit husband that comes to have sex with right and sleep right now. I curse you, I destroy that marriage. Wait, how many children does she have for you? How many children does she have for you? Three. How many children does she have for you? Three. I kill all those children now, one after the other. Right now, I release her from your hold. The, the cage is broken, the net is broken, and the bird is escaped. In the name that's above all, in the name of Yeshua, Amashia, by the blood of Jesus, I set her free right now. She's redeemed from every curse. And I place on her right now the mark of Christ. Right now, be restored. Be restored. Let your glory be restored. Let your health be restored. Let your way be open now in the name of Jesus. Out, all of you. Out. 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 You're back on the floor. Out. Right now. Out of her, all of you. Out. Right now. Out. Out of her. Right now. Out.
white fire on your head, on that crown, your back on the floor. Now, everywhere your power is in this body, I destroy it. In our brain, I destroy your power. Now, out of our head, out of our mind, out of our heart, go, all of you, fire right now, every part of you, fire right now, every part of your heart, fire right now, out of her. You spirit of death, you spirit of immorality, you ancestral spirit, out. Right now, and I command our rest restoration, our glory to be restored. You are free. A way is open. She's telling How are you feeling? How do you feel in your body? I feel like fire, like light. That is the light of Christ. Now you are going to begin to remember things. You have been forgetting things for a period of time now. You tend to forget things. Right? Yes. From now, your glory is restored. Your way is open. You are going to begin to remember things. Your way is open. Your door is open. Every militating, militating force that is from hell that is against you, they have been cast down. You are going to receive calls. You are going to receive offers and favor. You will, you will, you will even have to choose. You are the glory of your family. There is nothing anybody can do about it. Are you from a royal family? Yes. Mm. It's okay. You are free. The blood of Jesus covers you. No more sex in the dream. Every food you have eaten in the dream, every poison is coming out of you right now. Out. You are shaking. You spirit of snake out of her now. Out! You snake spirit now. Out! Right now, out go you foul demon spirit, you snake spirit. Out of her now. You are free. You are free. You are free. You are free. You will see what's going to happen to you. Don't just keep it, keep to yourself. The devil wants you to fornicate. He has been trying to frustrate you by all means. He has suggested many things to you, but God is with you. You are a, you are a chosen one. God is with you. The hand of God is upon you. That's why you were attracted to so God led you through the video you saw and then you reached out to me and God gave me grace to be able to reach out back to you because he's the one that is doing it. Please stay strong with Christ. Stay strong with Christ. I mean, you have been delivered tonight. You, have been, you are going to sleep. When you wake up tomorrow or when you wake up in the morning, tell me your dream. And don't, don't be afraid. You can reach out to me anytime. You can call me. Don't be afraid of anything. Right now, you have peace. Your way is open. Yeah. You, you feel peace right within yes. you and you were not feeling this hmm? yeah, very, I feel very tender I feel very like I feel very actually just like a slice I feel very easy mm. so I can find you worth it it's okay it's okay the Lord is with you. It's okay. The Lord is with you. It's okay. Say thank you, Jesus, for delivering me. Thank you, Jesus Christ, for delivering me. Delivering me. Thank you, Jesus, for delivering me. I appreciate you, Jesus Christ. Yeah.
I think I want to jump into how I feel right now. I know that, of course, you know, I haven't yet seen any supernatural monies. And I'm not saying I don't want these, but to be honest with you, the kind of joy and peace and... I think I can use the word separation. Like, I feel so light. I feel so easy. I feel so tender. I feel so malleable like i feel very not hard or confused or just mega out of order that that was how i used to feel before because a lot of things were just happening i lost my relationship i mean to god's glory i i i understand anyway i would like to think you know okay i've made great grades in these areas of my life why would i come to the uk and struggle my attention was just zero percent i mean i was almost always frustrated with a job or with this but it wasn't until i then realized winda you've not been watching your dream see what's been happening you know that's when i knew yeah this i need jesus and i really want to thank god that i couldn't even believe that i would wake up so early in the morning and feel very just present very feel very uh, I'm short of words and I would like to think I can communicate more effectively but I thank God that he could honor me this way I'm here to just testify to Jesus's glory that at his name I know I'd heard the word Yeshua Mashiach but he just kept saying in the name of Yeshua delivered be safe set free and also even in my dream with my dream this morning seeing the man of god and also seeing your chief added to bear i think it was the most i saw in my dream anyway um i can't just overflog that there is power in the name of jesus and like he gives power to set us free indeed from our past failures and heartaches and things that make us feel like how who's going to help me i mean i'm by myself you know my parents are not here my siblings are not here but god's grace has just found me and i'm eternally grateful to god and i know that i will be back back to testify to more of god's goodness in my life in jesus name praise the lord